welcome to this channel in this tutorial i am going to show how to install bun on ubuntu or linux and create a simple http server and run using bun javascript runtime if you are new to this channel subscribe this channel to get more tutorials let's get started bun is a first all-in-one javascript runtime it is the modern js runtime like node or deno it was built from scratch to focus on three main things first thing is start first it has the ease in mind and second new levels of performance extending javascript core the engine and third is being a great and complete tool like bundler transpiler package manager let's install bun cli using curl so open a new terminal at first install curl on your system using this command sudo apt install curl enter password and then copy this and paste into terminal okay now hit enter it may take a while for downloading one javascript runtime on your system okay now open this file in any text editor i'm going to open it on nano text editor and then scroll down and go to bottom of this file okay and then copy this two line and paste here this is the path environment variable for bun and then save this file press ctrl plus x from keyboard and then type y and then hit enter okay now apply the changes of bash rc file just type dot and then dot bash rc file okay now verify the installation type bun version use hyphen hyphen that's it and then type bun hyphen hyphen help and see the tools of bun runtime okay here are many tools dev bun create run install add remove okay let's create a simple http server using bun runtime so create a directory anywhere in your computer now navigate to this directory and open this directory in any text editor my case visual studio code is preferred okay now create a new file and name it http or anything else dot js and then scroll down and copy this code and paste here okay here port number is 
3000 and this is the default port here you see port to serve buns development server on default port is 3000 okay now i'm going to run this server using this command and then paste here this command now open web browser and browse this url localhost and use the port number 3000 that's it now stop the server and then start again and reload and see the changes if you like this video like comment and share thank you so much for watching this video